made it. We're here. We are at Solving and it is known as Little Denmark or the Danish capital of America. Solving is in Santa Barbara County, which is in the Santa Inez Valley. So there's like a lot of wineries around here. And it is really packed here. We were trying to get lunch at Paula's Pancake House and the lines were super long. We tried to sign up, but they stopped adding people to the list. And then we tried to go to Olson's Bakery, which was right beside Paula's Pancake, but that line was also really long. So now we're gonna try to get lunch at this place where we get sausages and fries. It's not open yet, right? Should we check in? It's not 11 yet. And they have a lot of outdoor seating. Right, so this is, we're gonna eat at the Copenhagen Sausage Company. Oh, Copenhagen Sausage Garden right here. sitting down and waiting for our food. We were like one of the first ones to line up. But yeah, look at the line. Wow, thank you. Wow, well, we must be really hungry. <laughs> oh, wow. On your sampler, these two are your all beefs. That's the kielbasa and that's the bratwurst. Awesome. We ordered a sausage sampler, pretzels, potato salad, fries, and my strawberry lemonade. <laughs> We just got done eating at the Copenhagen Sausage Garden and the sausage was really good. And now we're gonna try to just walk around and um, check out some of the shops. We did get cheese from that cheese shop. The lady was really nice. So we found the windmill, the big one, right there. This, this place is really busy. It's where all the shops are at. Um, and I think we're gonna check out some fudge. Well, I guess the line's not that long. Yes, please. Okay. Thank you. There's one on that one too. Actually, there's one on all of them. If you pan to the other roofs. We are done walking around solving 
It's a very small town. You can pretty much go to all of the shops and restaurants in a few blocks. That means it also gets really crowded. So if you're trying to eat breakfast or lunch, you might want to go there right when it opens so that you don't have to wait because the wait times are pretty long. The exteriors of the buildings are very much what I would imagine in Denmark because I've never been. But there's a lot of bakeries, a lot of restaurants, and it's a nice little kind of um, getaway, especially if you want to go to Europe right now and you can't. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next one. Bye. But that guy's watching me. Again? Yeah. Okay. But look at the camera.